hi guys uh, in today's video we are going to see how we can uh, create a task which can actually switch your keyboard so the main problem uh, we always face is uh, for few application we need uh, different uh, keyboards and for few application we need different so in my case when i use banking applications and i need to pa uh, type password so i want to like uh, see my keyboard as a computer keyboard uh, which is supported by I think Google so special characters are like uh, in the same way but uh, when uh, when you use Samsung keyboards they have a uh, different set of special characters uh, on the numeric keys so for that uh, it's really hard to you know go to the setting and uh, choose the keyboard so uh, I will show you what I uh, try to mean uh, by that so if you can see uh, this is uh, this is my uh, Google keyboard as you can see it has uh, different settings and all which is not available in the Samsung keyboard so when I uh, hit this play button so it will it should actually uh, switch it to the Samsung keyboard so when I uh, click play so it is saying switching to the Samsung keyboard and when I click on it now you can see it is uh, now a Samsung keyboard which is uh, really come in handy uh, and then you can just create a shortcut and uh, add it uh, whether as a floating icon or uh, in the in the main screen uh, in order to switch it quickly so let's just see how we can achieve that so uh, in, uh, before starting this uh, it is based on the auto tool so you need to purchase a plugin so it is costing around I think uh, 120 rupees something uh, when I last purchased it uh, due to some uh, special requirements I need to purchase that uh, I was working on some OCR related stuff so they have that OCR functionality so that is the reason why I bought this and then I see that uh, there are a bunch of oh, many uh, actions uh, available with this so I think uh, that is going to be a good buy so uh, let's see uh, how we can uh, create the thing so I will just create an action we can use create command and uh, type it like uh, switch example and I will click on right button and now uh, what we need to do is we need to add an action so action comes from the plugin so uh, we need to go to the plugin and then uh, we need to select auto tools so from auto tools uh, what you need to do is we need to uh, search for services uh, let's just see uh, whether we have any service with us or uh, maybe uh, first we need to go to the secure settings I think and then uh, from the configuration yes uh, so what you need to do is go to the secure setting and then from the secure setting you need to choose services so inside the services you will see input method so when you click on it it will list all the keyboards uh, available so you can choose uh, the keyboard which uh, you think uh, uh, you want to use it in the task so you can just click on it and uh, we just uh, go back and I will just click on the right button to save it and I will just go back again and uh, let's just try to uh, execute this so uh, first uh, before doing that uh, let me just see uh, what kind of keyboard we have so we have choose the uh, Google keyboard uh, Gboard and right now we have uh, Samsung keyboard so when I click on play it should uh, change our keyboard so if you again uh, select the keyboard and now you can see it's showing the keyboard so as you can see it's very easy to uh, add the task but there are few things which uh, really uh, like you need to consider uh, before uh, going into this so it is having a secure setting so you need to enable it by using adb command 
so you can go to the uh, when you install it for the first time it will ask you so you need to go to the developer mode and then you can just uh, go to the computer and using uh, powershell and you can just uh, like execute the command for uh, enabling the secure settings for the auto tools and then it will going to work so make sure that uh, you follow all the steps for the secure settings i will not going to cover in this task so uh, as you can see uh, it is working one another way i will uh, show you how we can use this so as you can see uh, uh, like how we can do that and uh, i have created a profile for that so in in the profile uh, you can see uh, there is uh, this samsung notes uh, profile so what i am uh, doing here is uh, when samsung note comes so it will going to switch it to the samsung keyboard and if uh, I, I will hide it like uh, i will minimize that uh, then it will going to the uh, gboard so uh, again uh, i have a c sharp compiler uh, so when i want to use it so here i am using hacker keyboard because it has a uh, full keyboard thing so in this way according to the app you can also uh, like choose one another so the way you can uh, achieve this is uh, using a profile and uh, then you can choose uh, application so when you do that uh, you can uh, create entry and exit tasks for that particular applications this another uh, thing which i am currently working uh, is uh, like uh, many times it happens uh, when uh, you don't uh, like uh, you don't have that application uh, to do that uh, you just want to uh, choose according to the need which is uh, not happen frequently so on those cases uh, i'm working on this one uh, so this is the task web screen so this is again uh, comes from the auto tools so when you click on it it will just uh, show the auto tools web screen uh, i think it's uh, still not oh, okay okay it's loaded now so it might be uh, taking some time so i have uh, used those two uh, icons and uh, if i click on g it will uh, switch to the uh, google keyboard and if i click on the s it will uh, choose the samsung keyboard so there are some uh, few uh, task uh, uh, which if you want to achieve them uh, you can use it like that so these are some examples of it so i think i have uh, covered this uh, so let's just summarize it uh, what i need to do is uh, if you wants to uh, change the input uh, which is a keyboard in our mobile uh, you need to use secure settings secure settings comes under auto tools plugin and in order to use it uh, you need to first uh, give some permission for the uh, writing secure settings uh, to the mobile and then uh, you can uh, like create a task and choose a uh, secure setting auto to plugins auto tools and then uh, secure settings and inside the secure setting you need to go to the services and inside the services you can go to the input mode so that's how uh, easy to you know uh, switch your things uh, to the like uh, you can choose different keyboards according to the own requirement i hope uh, you get some idea about how to use it uh, and thank you so much for uh, for watching this video and if you have any comments and question please comment below i will try to answer them as soon as possible and let's meet in next video bye